No, I just cleaned the, the manuals of the, of the cow to be sure it's pretty clean before I start milking. So there's not too much uh, things floating in the milk. All right, time for classical music. My name is Adrian. Well, I'm from France. I stayed on another farm where the owner made a PDC with town here. So she talked a lot about him, saying his place is wonderful. He's gonna teach you a lot. So I decided to apply here and I was lucky enough to have a, a space for me. So here I am. I worked in on several organic farms in New Zealand. And, and I mean, I'm from a place where we have lots of farms. So I kind of, I'm kind of used to this environment, I would say, but I'd never milk a cow before, for example. But it wasn't that difficult to learn. I had a good teacher who was a woman. So after like maybe 10 days, I was able to make a cow by myself. I would like to get my second year visa. It means I could probably stay here a bit longer or have another experience on another farm, another permaculture site somewhere or so. I've always said that to me, when you're doing woofing or helpix, you're not getting paid, okay. Well, you have food and accommodation and most of the time this is where you meet the most extraordinary people. Let's go, Choco. Let's go, Choco. I'm taking the cows to the uh, new paddock that they could graze somewhere else. They can't graze at the same place because at some point what's gonna happen is that they're just gonna eat all the grass and the paddock won't have time to recover. So you're just gonna destroy all the environment there. The more they eat, the more they produce milk also. Mm -hmm. 